best stats for us this time last season. It was quite a uh, damaging result. The draw here. Do you see it's different this time? Uh, a sign of Arsenal's potentially back in quality? It was an unbelievable game of football, one of the most intense and hectic games that I have witnessed in 20 years in this league. Um, the quality and the intention of both teams. It was superb to watch it and, and win as a team um, with our boys willing to, to play at that level, have the courage to play at that level, determination and belief to do what we've done here. I think my players deserve big, big credit. Jonathan? Yeah. Yes, it was a great action, and uh, there are certain opportunities against every opponent. We do that, and uh, we score from there. We should have done better in many situations. We had in the final thing open play because we generated a lot, um, and that's a little bit the, the regret. But uh, in the other end as well, it's true that they have some moments, especially the one after our corner when they went through, and we had a miscommunication at the edge, and, and it's a big quality of them, and, um, and we're lucky not to concede the goal. Kai from Football London. Oh, those three, they were phenomenal, but I think the whole team as well and, and, and how we step up to the level that they put today, which is one of the best Liverpools that uh, I've seen this year. Um, they make life really difficult. They became, the game becomes really, really chaotic. The crowds provokes that as well. But I think we handled the situation really well. Uh, there were a few players missing last year, big ones, um, that for us are really important, especially when you have to play these type of games that they propose. And you cannot get away from that game because they are really good at doing that. Um, but uh, then at the end, in the last 20 minutes, I think that the team was very willing to win it and they were really dominant and we really wanted to, to go and get the three points. And that's the only bitterness that we have um, after the game. Jordan? Yeah, we get so many balls away after regaining it, and that's the worst moment against them because they are really good on that counter press moment. And, and we lost it in areas as well that it's prohibited against them to do it. And uh, we could have been punished, but um, as we, we generated that our washing machine moments for them that they didn't like. Well, they've got certainly more experience. Um, what they, it was a very different game to last year, but the, what they've done today in this pitch, in this stadium, with the atmosphere that they created as well, that was something else. Uh, and the maturity and the courage that we showed, um, I think we should be really proud of our players. Thank you. You can't answer, Mikel, but compared to a year ago where you were this time last Christmas, do you, do you feel there's a, a few more experience? Do you feel there is a, an extra resilience to what, what you have there? Well, we have the experience of being where we are today and um, and we should be really happy because that shows a lot of consistency uh, for this new group in the best league in the world to do it for two years in a row. But uh, but that's it, you know, we are where we want to be right now, um, both in the Premier League and the Champions League. And we all deserve a beautiful dinner tomorrow with our families. But the next day we are back on it because when ta West Ham is going to be very, very tough again. Okay, bro. Oh, yeah. Yeah. What do you think your your team needs, or what do you want to see from your team in the second half of the season being so consistent now? Do you need to improve? Or? Yeah, of course, there are certain things that uh, that we have to improve, um, especially killing games, you know, with the amount of dominance that, that we are showing. Sometimes the results, they've been too close, you know, and we have to dig in the last few minutes um, to maintain results. Um, and that's it, nothing else. And hopefully we have sustained that level with five key players out. You know, because we lost five very, very, very important players for us for for many, for many, many months, and the team is still show that. So that's something that we really have to maintain, which is the the quality in the squad and and how willing they are to to do what they do every single day.